What's happening, world? This is Aldous Hodge. Hey, this is Armonia Rosales. I started off, this is all I knew. This, I just hate you, That's, that would make me happy. My mother, she is, um, or was, um, an author illustrator. She wanted me to kind of form my own style. So she would hand me, instead of teaching me, she would be like, oh, here's an anatomy book. See how the bones are and where it cannot bend and how the muscles form and the shadows. So I began observing and I am self-taught. I'm a lot of things. <laughs> Today I'm an artist, man, but uh, yeah, you know, uh, artist all around, actor, painter, uh, designer, builder, engineer, all those things that lead to, you know, this kind of stuff. Painting with emotion so we can, you know, add something or at least contribute something to, to our generation. As an artist, you never want to be boxed in. You want to be able to freely create everything. Um, to really express your creative ideas. This is a collection we've entitled Through the Looking Glass. They are, what, 15 and a half feet by seven and a half feet? Yeah. I would consider this a visual think piece because it does have a lot of meaning to it throughout the whole entire painting from corner to corner. Basically, the question we're asking our audience is how do you perceive cultures that you haven't personally engaged with? I've always um, had an interest in painting the underrepresented and that ranges from you know all cultures and religion. Like looking at her art is really the first time I've seen art and I said wow I need to see this. It hit me personally and I knew that she could teach me to be a much better artist. When I first saw his work it was it brought out all these emotions like I, I felt the same way that you said my figures make you feel, but it, it had it, it ran deep, and since we both love distress too, it kind of morphed into what you see in the back. Sometimes art makes people uncomfortable. For us, with our work, to a degree, that's the point. I really would love people to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. You know, we would love these pieces to be shown all over the world. We would love these pieces to be separated all over the world so the conversation can continue on a global scale. Thank you so much for taking the time. This is Aldous Hodge and... Thank you so much, Admonia Rosales.